When the triumphant Rebels returned from Denver with the championship trophy in hand, Las Vegas was waiting for them. At the airport, even though the gate was closed to the public, airport employees made sure the team had a welcoming committee. Uh, it feels great, you know, yeah. fans love us and we love being, you know, running Rebels. I had never really waited for this because I didn't expect this. So, you know, you always want to do the best you can, but the national championship has never been a goal of mine. It's just something that happened. Well, as the game started, I didn't think it was going to be that big. I really thought Duke was, you know, a great team. But we really got out the second half and played defense and did the thing we were supposed to and we came out with the victory. The rest of the town awaited the Rebels' arrival along a parade route that stretched from downtown to the Strip and then on to the Thomas and Mac. The Chamber of Commerce put on the parade so locals could catch a glimpse of the champions. And for some, a glimpse was about all they got. The parade moved quickly en route to the TNM, where thousands came to cheer the team one last time this season. Ladies and gentlemen, the nation's winning is collegiate basketball coach. And just when coach Jerry Tarkanian thought it was his turn in the spotlight, his players did a little upstaging. The ceremony had its lighter moments like that one, but for the most part, it was a time for the team to say thank you to Rebel fans. And, and one of the things I stress the most here is that next to my family, I love the hell out of you and LB fans. Thank you. If the Thomas and Mac is in heaven, it sure is far from it. I'd just like to thank all of you from the bottom of my heart to tell you how much I love all of you. You stuck with us through thick and thin. We had a lot of problems this year. We had a lot of people ridicule us, but you didn't shy away from us. You kept the support. You followed us through the ups and the downs. And we brought you the biggest stuff you could have in college basketball. And All-American Larry Johnson could not leave the stage without making a prediction about next year. Before I sit down, last word I have to say. Repeat.